How's it going guys? This is Jack. Welcome back to the channel. Well, welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved here on the Ragnarok Primal Fear Extinction Core server. Guys, I am so happy to be back playing some Ark. I hope you're happy to be joining me. We got a little bit of stuff to catch up on. Some of my personal stuff going on that I wanted to fill you in with and kind of let you know it's been a little bit of time since I've been able to play Ark, even though I've had some videos coming. But I'm going to get you caught up with that. But anyway, Guys, thanks so much for joining me and let's get started. All right, guys, so welcome back. And before I get into anything, um, I was just going to let you know. So last week, literally, I was in the middle of recording. Uh, my wife came down and she's eight months pregnant and she tells me she thinks she's going into labor. So... She actually ended up going into labor a month early. And uh, don't worry, the baby was delivered just fine. Both the mom and the baby are doing great. And the, everyone's home. Uh, it's a little crazy at that house with, uh, I already have a four-year-old. And uh, now, we have a, we, now we have a premature baby. But she's honestly doing great. Super healthy. Absolutely nothing seems out of the normal out of normal except for the fact that she was born a month early so we have we've had a lot of stuff we've had to catch up on which is kind of crazy because we really weren't ready we needed that last month to finish up a few things but oh well it happens life is great either way we're so happy and we couldn't be happier with uh with our little new little girl so anyway guys thanks so much for joining me just wanted to catch you up with that so a couple things I've been, uh, we've been taming some stuff in the last few episodes. So, you know, I've, I've, I was just looking around at my base. I've, I logged in. I was like, man, I don't really have, I don't really have much as far as like taming supplies. So I came over here. Uh, I, I, uh, crafted up some, some, uh, some of these, uh, potent trank bullets. And now I'm going to do some of these alpha blood bullets. So, these these will use on some of the uh, the heavy the heavy hitters that we really need to to hit because I believe this is look at this guys okay potent trank bullets are nine times more powerful than just a regular regular vanilla trank dart the toxics are eighteen times and the alpha infused are twenty seven times this could these could be one shots guys these could be one shots but in order for me to make it i actually make this need to make this alpha infused toxic narcotic which i actually don't even have the engram for so let's go into here and pop this up so what do you need you need one alpha blood and one toxic narcotic i got a bunch of that so let's see we'll jump into here let's just make all of it let's just do all of it guys because this stuff's super handy. Uh, I have, I, I did go ahead and bust out a bunch of bullets. I've made as much as I could uh, for the most part. Um, I still have, looks like I still have 100, 100 bullets left. Actually, hold on. Yeah, so I got plenty. I got plenty of bullets. 100 bullets left that I could keep making more primal bullets. But anyway, so that's how it goes, guys. You, you got to make the narcotic. Then you got to make, then you got to make the sniper bullets. And then from the sniper bullets, then you craft them into uh, primal rifle bullets, which I'm out of gunpowder, so I can't do any more. So the plan is, guys, I'm going to craft up, uh, looks like I'm going to have about 100. So, and let's see, I do have a bunch more toxic narcotic. So I'm going to craft these up, I'm going to craft up, I don't know, 100 trank bullets or so of those. And, and then we're going to go find something. Guys, the server's been doing, been uh, getting a little bit more popular. We've got a handful of people. I'm going to face this way so you can actually see my face in the light. We've got a handful of people that have joined us on the server. I think there's, um, I think we've got like five or six, maybe seven people that are subscribers of the channel. So if you are a sub and you want to play with us, just let me know in the comments. Uh, join the Discord join up we've got a handful of people some people have even tribed up tribed up together i know maya and both both maya and kobe are playing together they never knew each other and they're getting along great from what i understand 
Uh, as I said, things have been a little busy for me, so I haven't been able to really catch up with everybody. But I hope to kind of get time to to meet up with everybody on the server and you know have a chat and see how things are going. Maybe even find out about what we want to do next and, and what we want to do for the next server. So, uh, the plan, guys. I'm going to finish crafting up these bullets. Then I'm just going to kind of go start looking around. I'm, I'm going to fly around and see what I can find. And when I do, I will bring you guys back so that we can kind of tame something up together. There's so many cool things in this Primal Fear mod and in the uh, Extinction Core mod that I just haven't tamed up yet. So I want to see how that goes. So we're going to get started with that, guys. And I will bring you back as soon as I kind of have an idea with what, what I'm going to be doing. All right. Talk to you soon. Okay, guys. I think this would be a good one. Now, look. Apex Carquinos. Apex Crab, guys. Crab. It's only got 87,000 Torpor and it's, it's a level 200. I kind of want to see if it'll kill all this stuff. I'm going to just go ahead and wipe a few of these things out myself. My one thing is I don't want it to run away. I don't want it to run away because if it goes into that water... Let's go for it, guys. Let's go for it. Stay here. I'm going to go with this. Just We're going to see what happens with this. I wonder if I could try to get it over here near me and then unload on it. Real nice, like. Here you go. You come. He's a. Oh. Ooh, de deity of winter. Oh, he just got aggroed on me. Okay, perfect, perfect. Oh no. Oh my gosh, what was that, guys? What was that? Oh, I totally screwed that up. Okay. Luckily. I was locked and loaded. I may have hit it a few extra times. Or at least once or twice. Okay. What? Okay, these alpha... The alpha infused is so good, guys. It's so good. Okay, I'm gonna go back. I may have some exceptional kibble. I may not. Let's kill off a few of these things around here. And, uh, and I will bring you all back in a bit oh my gosh i can't believe i fell off right at that guy all right i'll see y'all in a minute all right guys um this may seem like a weird tame too to you guys but this will make it really handy for for doing metal runs with my inky nice we got him we got him all right um let's uh let's get him out of that hole it's like it's walked into a hole or something and let me get it back to base. Let's throw a saddle on it and let's see what happens, okay? Okay, guys, I'm back at base. Uh, 295 blue gems to make this Apex Carquinos saddle. Let's just get that up and let's see what I can find. I may have to... Oh, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. I think I have some. But I'd have to find them. Um, okay, let's see here. Might have to make up a bunch of dye. Uh, but, uh, let's see here. Not in there. Not in there. Let's go. Was it gem? 25. Oh no, I'm gonna need 25. Or, I'm gonna need a lot more. Let's do that. And then... Apex Carcano Saddle. Let me figure out, uh, I need a bunch of crystal. 250 crystal. And a bunch of blue dye. So, whew. All right, I guess I'll go do that. All right, so we got it. Apex Carquinos Saddle. Perfect. Oh, I need to get food. Let's grab some quick food. Too much, 500. No, I'm good. Okay. All right, now here, here she is. Is it a she? I don't think they have. Oh, it is a female. Okay, um, let's pump her health a little bit. Perfect. Now, one of the things I can do with this, guys, 
Is I can actually take it down into the water and I can like... I can use it for more... More base defense if I really wanted to. Hey. There we go. Piranhas. Take that. So I could definitely leave it down here for a nice little... A nice little, uh... uh base defense. But I can also do this. Uh, that guy. Perfect. Alright, let's see if I can get... Get up there. This guy. Uh oh, did I drop it? No, I still got it. Still got it. Perfect. Alright. It's gonna be so nice for doing some... A metal run. Just gotta figure it out the first time. Perfect. Okay. Come here, buddy. Awesome. So I was doing this before when I had to make a bunch of like spark powder and stuff. I was just running, running this guy, flying it with the Anki. So this, or with the RG. So this will be... This will be pretty nice to be able to get what I need and not have to and not have to use the uh the RG. It's definitely will make me happy. Oh my gosh, guys, look at this. Look at this. A juvenile megalodon. My sharks My sharks have got a megalodon here. I do have them on Wander, and Maya actually told me that she came and claimed one and took it back to her base, which I think is great. Go for it. That's so funny. Uh, okay. <laughs> Hopefully this thing lives. Another shark just roaming around. Let's tell it to unfollow me. All right. I think that's so funny, guys. All right. Let's, uh... I should probably check... Check the food on these guys, by the way. Ah, they're fine. They're fine. Let's get some more food on this little guy. Okay. Whoa. Okay, guys. Um. I. Is that? Yep. A dark griffin level 600. Now, I'm a little afraid to try to tame this guy. Because, uh... Whoa, was that a Thyla? And we got a Thyla? Colio, level 200, just a vanilla. Um, I'm a little afraid, because this guy, I think, could probably wreck me. 775,000 torpor? Uh, the other thing is it takes 13 kibble. So... Hmm, the question is... Do I have enough feathers? Oh, hey, look at this. We also got an artifact of the great, which 10 million health on that guy. That would be a nice, like, nice kill to get. Um, I think I might just knock this guy out just for the heck of it. At least try 775. I don't know what my, let's see. Let's get up here. I got my alpha infused. That did 40k. Oh gosh, he's coming. Oh, he broke me. Okay, I just need to empty two more mags out. Out. We should be good. We should be good. Let's get him. I'm a little broken. I'm healing. I'm broken. I should be fine. Where is he? Oh, we got tribesmen over there. I don't want to mess with them at the same time. Oh, there he is. 
We're gonna try to knock him out. Where do I wanna knock him out? That's the question. That is the question. Oh, I miss. Completely miss. Okay, I need a full mag. Let's let him land. Perfect. No. No, I ran right through my bird. Oh. Uh, what's he at? Yep. Should be able to get him one more mag. Should be good. One more clip. Oh, he's at, he's de-aggroed already. Man, these things de quick. So the nice thing about this, guys, this thing is so strong. And I've had one before and they're so awesome. I missed. Oh, he's running. It's like, I got like, I need like one shot. Oh, is he down? Nope, he's not down. Oh no, he left out render range. Guess what, buddy? Is he down? He's down. He's down. Oh man. Okay, back to base. Uh man, last time I tamed one of these things a long time ago. <laughs> In my previous series, man, it took me a while because I had to keep, keep doing, um, keep killing elementals to get the feather. So, all right, let's go back to base and let's see if we can, uh, we can luck out. I don't know how many I have, so let's go see. Okay, guys, so, uh, I have everything I need except for raw prime meat. Or, sorry, not raw prime meat, but, uh, cooked prime meat. So I am, we're working on that. It's going to take a little bit of time because I need like a couple hundred prime meat. Uh, let me just show you. Let's see. What are we at here? Ten, nine, nine, ten, eleven, and I'm going to run out of prime meat. It takes a hundred prime meat per kibble. Luckily, I have everything that I need except for that. So just got to wait for this prime meat to to cook up so i guess we'll see what happens this is taking a while i need i need 140 prime meat roughly so uh, we'll see what happens gonna take a while i'll bring you guys back when i'm when i'm further along oh my gosh okay looks okay let's do a quick scan with this okay i don't see anything guys i got it, it took quite a while it took 30 minutes or so i think Let's drop that on and drop that on and feed it that. That should work. 300 levels. This is going to be a 900 roughly. Oh, baby. 13 elemental kibble. I don't think I'm going to make any elemental kibble for quite a while because I'm going to run out. Uh, or I've pretty much ran out. I've tapped out of everything that I needed. All my feathers. I'm gonna have to go kill a bunch of elemental stuff. Okay. Just hit it with one more of these. That's okay. These are cheap, right? Okay, one more bite, I think. Yes! Dark Griffin! Got 297 levels. It's, tor it's melee damage is 1550. And it's got almost half a million health. Oh my goodness. Let's go see what this thing can do. It's a little... It feels slow compared... I mean... <laughs> it harvests stuff so quick. Wonder how much damage I can do here. Should I try to kill this? Uh, maybe I'll try to kill this. Uh, uh, 
What was it? Oh, hey, what do we have? We've got a uh, basilisk. Level 200 basilisk, that should be easy. Pretty easy. Pretty easy. Now these things are just so powerful. It's like an alpha pteranodon. Let's eat that up because I need some more alpha blood after. Thank you. Eat that up. Oh, there we go. Okay. This Artifacto the Great level f or 580 with 10 million health. I'm tempted. I'm real tempted. I do have some stuff here. I could, if I need to heal my guy up, he's already got 26 levels. Let's get him up to a million health. Have him eat one of those and then start hitting melee damage. Let's hit him. Being a flyer, even though he has really good Really good, uh, 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 melee damage like that. This thing's got a lot of health. I should be able, to, I should be just fine. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fight him with this on. It didn't even touch him. He's got just as much as he had before. I'm gonna have to, like, put a lot of damage. Okay, so he's summoning stuff, which I don't know what he's summoning from the sky. Let's keep hitting him. And I don't think he's hit me yet, so that's fine. Should I... Do I dare do a dive bomb? Do I dare do a dive bomb? That's the question. Maybe not with the water. And I just plain miss him. This is gonna take so long. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna work on this guy for a little bit, okay guys, and then I'll bring you guys back. All right, guys, I don't think I'm gonna keep doing this. I've been working on it for a while, and I've knocked off about a million health, but oh, I just can't I can't be bothered can't be bothered to keep doing it. What is that? Alpha roll rat? Yeah, let's kill that guy. Perfect. More alpha blood to the rescue what I need oh man this thing is so cool guys all right guys I think I'm gonna end it there actually got a couple really nice tames this dark griffin has a lot and does does a lot of damage now uh it's gonna be interesting to see but um this this may do more damage than anything else so than anything else that I have. I'm not sure. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to play around with it a bit. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, be sure to hit that thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. This thing is awesome. All those feathers, man. All those feathers feathers really came in handy. Luckily, I had a bunch. So, if you want to get yourself an awesome tam, go get yourself one of these dark griffins. They do so much damage. I remember this being my favorite. Next to the Celestials, the Dark Griffin was one of my favorite, favorite teams that when I played Primal Fear in the past. But anyway, guys, thanks again, and we will talk to you later. Bye-bye.